While scrolling the internet, I came across an interesting post that I found on Reddit. I make $180,000 and my girlfriend makes $40,000. How should we split our $3,000 rent? Hey guys, I'm Mike. And if I could change this Reddit article to reflect my life, it would read something like this. I make $80,000 a year and my girlfriend makes $40,000 a year. How should we split our $700 a month rent? But this article is not about me. So my goal today is basically just to have an open discussion about this and see what everyone's thoughts are. Diving right in, I guess I'll just share my initial reaction to this. Um, so I have a background in accounting, so I deal with numbers all day. So my first reaction after reading this post is trying to take all the emotion out of the actual post and just looking at it from a numbers perspective. So the first thing I wanted to do was basically take out my uh, handy dandy calculator. Got it right here. And I would basically split the rent based on the proportion of income um, that the girl makes to the guy. So for instance, I would do $40,000 divided by $180,000 and it comes out to 22%. So I would then multiply 22% by the $3,000 rent, and then I would charge my girlfriend $667 a month for rent. Uh, that was my initial response, um, just purely looking at it from a numbers perspective. But it's not about what I think, it's about what the internet thinks, maybe. Um, the internet can definitely be a toxic place. But I do wanna kinda go through some of these comments that I found. You can imagine the the different types of comments that people said. I'll, I'll pick I'll pick a variety, and then um, I did find one comment that I think is the right answer. I think most people would think maybe there's a right answer, maybe there's a wrong answer. I think I can definitively say that there is a right answer to this this post, this question. So let's dive into some of these uh, responses and see what people think. So first person from Vanessa, Vanessa says, I think you should pay, just pay the rent, Lord. But if you must take her for her pennies, 80-20 split. So the guy pays 80%, the girl pays 20%. So what, what did we have, 40? Yeah, 20, so yeah, I, I, I upped it a little bit. I was charging her 22%, so um, yeah, my numbers are pretty close to what Vanessa said. Let's keep, let's keep moving and see what other people think. LaBelle commented, 40,000, why is she even working? If there was that big of a pay gap between the couple, uh, maybe, yeah, you'd have to rethink who's working and who's staying at home. Uh, but who knows, maybe she enjoys her job, maybe she's a teacher, she likes teaching children, who knows. Mike said, bro, just pay the rent. Yeah, you're making forty. You're making forty thousand. Or sorry, you're making one hundred and eighty thousand. It's a lot of money. Um, I definitely wish I was making that much. This one's kind of. <laughs> this one shouldn't surprise you, but uh, HP said if she is a feminist, fifty fifty split. So she pays fifteen hundred. The guy pays fifteen hundred. I think that's a funny comment. <laughs> It appears that this person tried to do the math, but he did the math wrong. Um, so this person basically agrees with what I said, but he got the wrong, he got different numbers. He said split in proportion of income, in my opinion, 75% to him, 25% to her. Understanding and agreeing financials in a relationship is super important. Um, I think that's probably the most where I initially stood um, before even reading these comments, that's kind of where I was, where my head was. Uh, but yeah, he must have rounded up because uh, the, the actual proportion is 22%. But yeah, growth, I uh, grow your wealth. Um, I would say I ha I'd have to initially agree with you. 
Um, Kevin said, get married and take care of her. Definitely an option. Interesting. Yeah, so actually, not a lot of comments on this, but... Um, yeah, so different varieties. Some people said... I guess I, I did skip one. Let's see. Um, why Marie says, support that woman and watch her make that house a home. Good perspective. But yeah, a lot of different answers. Surprisingly, there's not a lot of comments on this, so maybe... Maybe this was recently posted, but I feel like I've seen this before other places. Um, yeah, so in summary, some people think if you go the, the feminism route, it's 50-50. So each each splits the $3,000 a month, so 15 by each person. Um, others tend to side more with the woman. Uh, maybe the guy pays the, his fair share and then... Um, Maybe the women, the woman doesn't pay as much or doesn't pay at all. Um, one curveball, and this is before I I share you the correct answer because I think there is a correct answer here. Um, before I share that answer with you, the curveball. Let me just um, let me just rearrange the original post and see if that changes your mind at all. I make $180,000 and my boyfriend makes $40,000. How should we split our $3,000 rent? So basically the curveball was, we basically just switched roles. Now, assuming it's boyfriend, girlfriend. Now the girlfriend is the breadwinner bringing in $180,000. And now the boyfriend is bringing in the lower amount, $40,000. So I'll let that sit for a minute and I guess ask yourself, does that change your initial opinion or are you still solidified in your original opinion? And it'd be, it would be very interested to see what some of the comments, if, if we could pose this new question, it would be interesting to see what their response would be. So LaBelle initially said 40,000, why is she even working? Um, so I'd be interested to see if she had the same stance um, given that the guy in the relationship was making 40000 If If the guy should stay at home and the girl should work. Um, just, just, just a thought experiment. Something, something to get the gears turning. Again, there, I think there is a correct answer and I'm going to read it here. Yeah, the, the feminism comment, 50-50, so I guess that wouldn't really change. If you're doing 50-50, it wouldn't matter who's making what. And then my initial response was the numerical dollars. So the person making 40,000 would be paying 22% of the rent. So $667 a month. That That's just purely numbers. Numbers, no, no emotion involved with that. So that really wouldn't change. Well, I guess that would change because yeah, she the girl started paying 667 and now she's paying 2,333. Um, so that's if you switch the roles. One person's making more than the other. Well, the, the final comment, I, I kind of just want to end with this. And I think this is, I'll tell you why I think this is the best comment. Um, this person said, and th I think this is the correct answer in this situation. I, so I think the correct answer comes from Kansi. Kansi says, no right or wrong answer, whatever works for you two. A split relative to both income is fair and should suffice. Um, so, so maybe you don't agree with the second part, but I think the first part would be the correct answer. Um, there's really not a right or wrong answer. I mean, as a couple, if you're going to be living together and assuming maybe you're going to get married or maybe you're not going to get married, it's ultimately your choice on what you decide. So some people might think the guy should should pay and the girl should stay home, but ultimately it doesn't really matter what they think because it's the couple's decision no matter what. So that's really what it comes down to. Um, you may not agree with the second part. He said a split relative to both income is fair and should suffice. Um, that was basically my initial stance. Um, so. Whether or not you agree with that, that's up to you. But the first part, no right or wrong answer. Ultimately, it's going to come down to whatever the couple agrees upon. 
As I close out this video, just do me a favor and go down to the comment section and leave your response. What would you do in this situation if your significant other was either making more or less than you when it comes to paying rent? Let me know down in the comments below and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Stay frugal, fam.